is a dried tamarind pod. And inside is that tangy pulp. And this is the pulp. And this is gonna make my fish soup nice and sour. It's called kanchu ka. And because it comes in a block, I just soak it in some hot water and then sieve it through to get all the fibers out. So I'm left with this nice tangy, tangy sauce. And now for the fish. I like to use red snapper for this. You know, it's, it's lean, it's firm, and it's really versatile. And I just asked my fishmonger to take out the pin bones because I don't want to deal with that at home. <laughs> I like red snapper because it holds its shape in the soup. The seasoning is super easy. Salt helps to get that fishiness out. Pepper. And some chili powder for that heat. This is kind of like the hot and sour soup, the Thai soup tom yum. Yum. Mm. Pineapple. It's sweet, tart, and juicy. And I have three other heroes for this soup. The juicy and sweet tomatoes, savory onion. And take a look at this. This is an okra. And I've heard that it's actually a beauty secret for young, youthful skin. <laughs> Okay, so time to cook up the soup, and there's an order to this. Keep the fish and okra last. Start with the onions and get that aroma going. There's so many flavors going in. That tamarind pulp. And the tamarind, it's really sour, so balance it out with some fish sauce and some sweet sugar. Mm. And this is a favorite spice of mine, cumin. So the onions have cooked down a little bit. Now for some fish broth. rice at the bottom, jasmine. I love the fragrance. Pour the soup on top. Oh, that fish, it's falling apart. It's so soft. And garnish, some fresh bean sprouts, and some fresh cilantro to add that final touch of green and freshness. Mmm, that's such a pretty soup. First, just the broth. Wow. It's called sour soup, but it's not like that. Like crazy sour, it's this delicate sour. And it's such a quick and easy dish, but it kind of captures the essence of what Vietnamese cuisine is. Mm. <laughs> Fruits and seafood. It's a very Vietnamese combo. 